How pretty is this? This is a Ginny Spring. out to meet Jim having a day down in Leicestershire um, Great Central Railway I think is the uh, focus of today so I've just called off at the services a little bit of breakfast it's Leicester Leicester Forest no it's not Leicester Forest I can't remember the name of this services uh, Trowel, that's it, Trowel. Interesting characters around at uh, 8.30 on a Sunday morning, I can tell you. Right, next stop, Lutterworth. I'm out with this chap. I'm out with Jim. We had all sorts of plans to, to expand. Because it was, it was the forerunner of the um, of HS2, essentially. Because oh, yeah. it was so, everything was trying to be so straight. They didn't have a lot of curves in it on the track all the way to London. It was fairly straight. It's a shame. It did get run down, didn't it, in, in the end? Yeah. Did that open before the Great Central closed? What, when did yes, the M1? It did. It did. 60s. Uh, yeah, it did. And I'll tell you what happened. There's a, there's a final bridge of the GCR at Cosby. Yeah. And we might call in there and get up and try and get up on the track bed there because the, the final bridge, it's the last bridge that was built on the. Ah. Heavy going this bit. Lots of sharp objects. I'm saying the first thing I thought when I saw this is Spinkill Tunnel. A little bit more imposing. Maybe that's just a trick of the imagination, I don't know. Standing right on the side of the wings here. My wife would be having kittens if she could see me. But I am insured. And she keeps telling me I'm worth more dead than alive. But thankfully my wife doesn't watch this kind of nonsense. Um, where next, Jim? Well, I've got a choice. We can either stop off and try and get on the last bridge that was ever built on the GCR over the M1. We're lost. We're quite literally lost. If you like a hit with a fall, you'll be alright. <laughs> There's a fellow with a flag over there. I swear. Barbed wire to the right of me, those to the left. This better be worth it. Yeah. So this was uh, this was the last one to put the M1 down. They had to put the over the bridge, uh, over the uh, over the M1. Is it? That was easy. 
Oh, I was expecting big, tall metal fences. That was your top. Not much to see on top, is there? Are they still sponsored by Walkers? Welcome to Leicester, part five, Leicester city centre. No idea what they are in those bowls. Today's uh, filming suddenly taking a very urban feel. Look at that, an old little, random little arch. It's not railway related, it's just a nice bridge. It's nice. Lovely, isn't it? Hello. Hiya. Do you want to take some photos? No, not at all. Thank you very much. What are you taking them for? We're just railway enthusiasts. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. We're not, no, no dodgy reasons at all. No, no. <laughs> and if you're an estate agent, then um, have a problem. No, I'm not. Definitely not, no. So that's four platforms that we've got here then, all yeah. together. Two island platforms, basically. Actually, really great. There's actually more to look around here than there is at the Sheffield oh, Great right. Central Station, isn't it? Because you yeah. can't really get no, up that much on top no, of there, no. apart from the hotel. But here you've even got the platform. Yeah, there's a lot more to uh, that's accessible up here, isn't there? This is all filled in, obviously, it's all concreted in, but um, you've got one, two, three. So that's it from Leicester Central Station, Prime. Um, prime parking spot here. So we'll move down to another location in the city centre now. <laughs> yeah, she's very friendly. Yeah. <laughs> See, that's an old carriage, but it's really not an old carriage, is it? It's the big one. Yeah. Oh, it is. Yeah. Was nine F's. Some of that last. Showing the cafe was closed. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I could do with a cup of tea now. It's starting to go a bit nippy, isn't it? Yeah, it's just starting to get. Yeah, it's just getting cool. So I'm in Clown Linear Park and some stage last year, I think it was this summer, could be wrong, they, uh, they installed some information boards along the park. Now the park's built, it's called Linear Park, it's built along the, um, the track bed or around the area around the track bed of an old disused railway line. Oh, you can tell, you can tell how out of fitness I am just by walking up here. I used to run up here year or two ago <laughs> I'm just struggling to even walk up this week <laughs> <laughs> 